In this video, we're going to go over how to create an ad like the one that you're seeing right there for the houses. And we're going to use Mid Journey to do that. We're going to create some images. The idea of this is for a real estate or housing developer. If you had a housing subdivision or something like that and you wanted to show off a certain type of house, in this case, we're going with a craft, craftsman style house. We're going to be able to generate some some images that can help us build a really cool ad graphic. So in this scenario, we have a North Carolina housing subdivision that has new construction going up, starting at 400K for the houses. So we're in Mid Journey and we're providing these prompts. You can see we're working here and we're providing these prompts to Mid Journey and we're asking it for the best images that out of the four that it provides us. If you hit the, the U, it'll give you this upscaled version of whatever image you ask for. So we're taking those images and then we're going to move into using this software called Pixlr X and it's a freely available software that you can just get online and we're going to take those images in there and we're going to use them. And so here you're seeing me um, you start up the Pixlr template which we just go move in here and crop and stylize some of the images to work the way that we want. We're going to overlay some text and we're just going to use a box there just to build out everything the way that we want. Now if you want to learn how to do this more, I have a full course where I go over an uh, entire project, a very in-depth um, coverage of how to use mid-journey to create visuals like this. So in this case I'm just using houses in the course we get into a little bit more of an artistic side but depending on what you need to do as a professional, you know, you don't have to be an artist to leverage uh, Mid Journey. You don't have to be making, uh, you know, some sort of just entertainment based thing. You can use this as a professional. So if you're interested in that course, check out the description below and I will cover that. So um, I hope that this video has been helpful to you. If it was, please hit that like button. If you want to see more content about how to use AI tools, subscribe to my channel. And thank you so much for watching.